All right, we're back. We're gonna do the last nine games of ECQ. Yeah, this is, it's been strange. It's been, it's been crazy. I've been stopping and starting recording times, not in increments of seven games, which is kind of like when I'm like, I need a second, I need a second. And uh, the last match we had, we uh, could not figure out how to use burn spells against units. That will be, <laughs> I'll be like, Parmley, this is my misplay of the week. <laughs> So to tell him. Okay. Casey Nebrev. Let's just not do what we did last game. We'll be fine. Yeah, good. No burn spells, just units. This should be fine. Okay. Uh, yeah, I think this is a good trade. Okay. Um, now we need to play this. And uh, we got a seer, so let's see if we can correctly kill Varret with a seer. Shouldn't be hard. Shouldn't be difficult. Okay, let's get a... Let's just swing in, right? Let's think about this for a second. Um... We're gonna exhaust that. Yeah, let's exhaust this. Let's see. <laughs> Kicking some butt. Fire versus fire. I'll take the trick. Even better. Okay, so now... I wouldn't mind taking out either of those units. Awesome. Let's invoke. And then let's get the Burning core Drake. What's our opponent doing? Okay. Let's do this number. I'm assuming they have a burn. Nope. Okay, we're good. So this is looking like it's going a little bit better than last game. I don't even want to talk about last game anymore. We're done. Last game was so yesterday. Okay. So we need to play this. And then, as a result, we can go like this. Oops. Alarm's going off. Good morning. Let's get rid of those. Okay, we're closing in on the finish line on this match, at least. Good game. Oh crap, we're up against Nightmare. Um, and we want to keep this hand. We're gonna start out with the uh, emblems, just so we can potentially have the fire sigil around for Jack. Okay, yep, so let's start with the emblem. Okay. Up against dragons. <laughs> Dang it. <laughs> their their two drop stats is a little bit better than mine. Stats are better than mine. Anyways, yeah, proper English. I don't do it very well. Very well. Roska destroyed with a seer. 
Nope, not yet. I don't have one of those. Okay. Okay. I think I'll play Burning uh, Burning Core next. Yeah, it's a bur Burning Core Ultimatum. And then I can drop uh, this. We'll just see what happens. Oh, come on. Okay. Okay. What do I do now? Okay, so let's go Kazuo. Let's hit this. Also, I want to exchange this for, uh, let's go with, um, hmm, kind of want to get a Caleb's favor. Some damage going with that. Because mm. the Phoenix Zone doesn't really get past the dragon, so again, they're most likely doing the whole dragon plan. They're going to kill the Kazuo, but at least it'll take their turn up. Yeah, now that I think about it, maybe playing the Cosmo wasn't the right plan there. And I probably needed the Phoenix Stone. Hey, but this works. Thanks, deck. My deck's like, well, if you can't make your own plan, I'll give one to ya. So we're on their four turn clock. And they're on a five turn clock. So are they waiting to play dragons? Until they get that? Ooh, that's not good. We've got to have a dragon, right? So they're going to bring her back. That's the problem. Um, so let's... You know, we got to do it eventually. It's got to happen. I have no belief in my heart that they don't have a dragon in their hand. Come on, just play the dragon. If you don't have it, that's fine. Okay, cool. <laughs> okay, even better. Um, let's show it. Let's start with drawing a card. What are you doing? Ah! Dang it. Okay. Oh, uh, hey. Warp that off the top. Anytime. Cinder Cinder Yeti is pretty awesome. Um. So what I want to do is attack, right? Is that it? Start an attack. Oh, oh. Okay, then let's go Burning Core Drake and Covet a Stranger. And they're different unit types of Blight Moth can't hurt us. I mean, it can hurt us, it just won't do the most amount of damage it could. Oh, uh, carve it with Blight Steel. That would be the worst nightmare. That would be the worst, comma, nightmare. <laughs> That's pretty bad. Okay. So, I guess let's exhaust that. We have to go wide. Now they have a two drop three three. That kind of prevents us to some extent. We can get we get three damage in next turn, and that's, let's say, three, four, five damage. What the heck just happened? It has other abilities? <laughs> Dang it. Okay. So they're pushing for damage. Um, seven, eight. Oh, they teased us. They teased us so bad. Well played, Nightmare. That was a lot of kill spells. 
I don't know if we can get there. 19 wins. We're going to see if we can get to 19 wins even. We need to crank them out now. Uh, we'll keep this. And um, overall, I've had a blast. This is a good. This is a good little tournament we've been in. Uh, big tournament. Um, and on that note, uh, let's see how high we can climb as far as uh, prizes go and ladder goes. Hmm. No. No, no, no. Yes. Okay. Uh, let's go with this. We don't mind. Um, and then let's just sear it so we can swing. And that's our best bet. We know we want to play the Yeti, but we also want the Varit gone. Barret? Oh, Barret gone. Or should I say Horus Traver? Da da da. Da da da. Okay, um, let's save that last sigil. And I don't believe I wanna. Yeah, let's just play the card. Honestly, let's do that. Okay. Um, now that I think about it, we probably could have played Barret. It's probably a pretty good card, honestly. Um, hmm. I kind of want to invoke here. Like this. Okay. And now much mastery it needs to hit twice. Okay, good. Um you get trade there. Okay. Let's go Cookmaster and um, Ash Elemental. Let's see where that gets us. Ooh, about to get pinged like crazy. Yep, ouch. Uh, no blocks. have to kill Varret. Swing here. The reason to use the gambit. Taking Grin is another good choice. Oh, they're running. They're actually um, running time. Okay. I didn't know. Hey, that's a good, good refill, though. It's a really good refill. Okay. We know we have something. I think they think we have Seer. Uh, I guess we'll kill that because we can. And we'll kill this because we can. We're just going to play it. I think we misplayed there. We could have decimated and saved the Tota. Or whatever. Not the Tota. Yeah, the Tota. That's okay. Fortune has given us another one. So that'll be a 1 1. Is the 1 1 good? In this case, yes.
Okay. So the overwhelms are really killing us here. Literally. <laughs> Good game. Well played, Nick Ben. Up against Haksumi. We'll keep this. Go ahead and drop the Ruthless Stranger. Okay, next. Go with the emblem. So we go for two. Want the Yeti? Hmm. See a couple of Wraths of Kaifas here. Hmm. Okay, what can we do here? We gotta shut those alarms off. We'll figure that out in a minute. Um, hmm. Let's go with. <clears throat> let's just attack. How oh, will we gain? Two power? So, no, nothing really too crazy there. Just go for it. So let's play but Sigil, right? Hmm. Play the Tota. Let's swap a card out. We're not killing anything, so we're not playing the Tota. We're gonna get like two more damage. Oh no. Another burning core Drake. And we've got this up just in case we uh, see a unit to destroy. Okay. Um, let's, what are we at? No master yet, I forgot I just played that last turn. Okay, when they play something, we need to divert. We can give this a little buff. Ah. Ah, dang it. Okay. So at least this can happen. Good game. Woo. Okay, up against Def Hobbit. Hmm. We'll keep it. This is kind of crazy to keep, but we'll keep it. Sky Craig, okay. Let's start with the uh, good old Ruthless Stranger so we can get that bonus off of Covetous and preserve our ultimate for Coswell because it is precious. It's a good, it's a good little four drop. Four drop ability. Drop this, swing in. I like our little uh, Stranger package. This deck has been a blast to pilot. Um, Thanks once again, uh, Sunnyvale, for like winning with this deck and inspiring me to use this as like the premise for not this deck, but the uh, the version that this is based on, the mono red with all of the cards, like all the cards, <laughs> pretty much 
most of the cards in this deck are from the Sunnyvale edition. So, how are we going to do this number? Let's start with a sigil. Let's go with this. Yeah, this will be good. Now, if they get Oni Grunts, we're in big trouble. This wouldn't be too bad in this deck. The Tattoo Dragon. I had it in my Mono Fire Dragons, and it was very good. Okay. Ugh. That's why turn to see is good. Just. <laughs> yeah, this is going really well for them. Unfortunately, for me. Okay. So, uh, yeah. That was a whole turn. Wow. Wow. Okay. Um. Pretty aggressive start right there. Let's see. If we can make it to victory. Okay, so if we can really crunch some damage in, we can get them. Twelve life. I don't know what they're grabbing out of their market, but we shall see. Okay, let's kill here now. We gotta preserve the most amount of life, uh, most amount of life right? So 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. That'll put us at 6. So we could be at. We could be at 9 or 8. Let's just block a 3 1, right? I think that pretty much got us. Let's see. We go with Milos. That'll be six, seven, eight damage. After blocks. Double damage gets us. Good game. Well played. <laughs> All right, Grandar. Let's. Hmm. I think we can keep this. Seems good. Start out with the emblem of Shavka. Okay, so now we can use this to decimate.
which will put us at five. We can drop Milos and swing. That's a good start. <laughs> That's kind of what we're looking for there. Woo! It's a lot better than the hands we've been getting. Okay. Uh, we get a power boost. Let's swing out. For, oh no. Yeah, okay, so we spin one. Yeah, it's Blazing Salvo. Oh, if we see Blazing Salvo and then they Blazing Salvo, it could be really bad. But, in the plus four, we could have a... It's kind of a hard choice. Yeah, I think we just swing out, right? Let's do it. And then honestly, I'm dropping the jack. Uh, probably could have done the jack just next turn would have done more damage doing the four and gaining double damage, honestly. Now they're just looking for answers, I believe. Probably should have waited. Yeah, that was kind of a misplay. Any unit they play, though, we take care of. up okay permafrosted that's fine um now let's blazing some of that I think yeah let's blazing some of that and I think we turn in the sigil to get the Phoenix Stone. And we get that so we can charge in with the Phoenix Stone in tow. And A space. Perfect. That gets us ready for next turn. Good game. Well played. All right, up against Gregapem. And we're not keeping that. Let's redraw. We can keep this. Oh, our, uh, hopefully we don't get turned to seed like we did in the other game, because we have three Toad Pioneers here. Okay. Much preferred. Much preferred. Um, and then let's drop a Cinder Yeti. I'll drop two Total Pioneers. And then if they get turned to Seated, then dang it. Oh, uh, we might just Total Pioneer Seer. Yeah, I think that's what we're going to do. Well, we're going to Seer and then Total Pioneer. That order is better, I guess. All right. Now, I don't exactly know what we can use this Cinder Yeti for, but I think we could figure it out. We we might I mean, it might just be for a Blazing Salvo. We'll see. Oh, yeah, we got the Toad right here. Let's use that. Buff it up. Alright, there we go. And the next turn we'll have enough to buff it and play another unit. Ooh, restrained action, ouch. That hurts us. 
there it is a lot okay um so let's buff this that's a good use of our power and then swing out we'll play cookmaster Griffin Patriarch, okay. That's a lot of card draw. Alrighty. Let's see what we can get done here. Hmm. Blazing Selva gives us a lot of options. Hmm. Do we just want to push for damage? could just swing in with the you know what we could do let's get um i mean the blazing cell doesn't do much here but we can actually get the cells fury let's get rid of one of these uh, i put it probably should have played the Toto pioneer first that was a misplay um yeah that's okay and then so then we can play this to kill that let's activate this ability and swing in. <laughs> oh man. Ava. I lens elite. Lots of cloud snakes. That's rough. <sighs> At least we have uh, Cinder Yeti. We, I think we want to exhaust Ava. Man, they have a lot of units. And, hmm. yeah, I think where we're hitting our problems is the restrained action at this point. If we could just get a dragon, we'd be fine. We don't want to attack with two. We don't want to attack with two units. Yeah, this is getting this is getting out of hand. Grigapim's got us. card advantage. Okay. Um, yep, and then the elf will trade. More clouds next. Dang. We still have a lot of health though, so I guess we could just take this damage. Uh, only thing we can block is on the ground, and we don't have enough power to actually kill it, so we'll just block. Got permafrost here. We don't have a lot of answers that could get us out of this. Um, I think I'll just drop the Toto Pioneer and see what happens. They have one heck of a board state. Oh, they got a way low Sky Tactician. And I mean, it, it seems like we're in a good position as far as our health goes, but man, they're just attacking so much. It's they, they got a lot of flyers. Let's 
Let's go cover this stranger. We'll use the ability. Uh, there's never really any point in using the ability. Because I mean, they got a 2 5. It was exhaust. I don't know what I was thinking. But yeah, they got us. That was a good game. Well played. Oh, man. Who were flyers? We're up against D. Lopez. And I think I'll... I think it's dangerous to keep. Or we'll redraw. Oh, got a Kazuo for our first turn. Okay, cool. Alright. Lars favor. All right, all right. Um, one in turn. Get this burning core Drake, and hopefully doesn't get far as favored. Start turn. Let's go with emblem. Drop an ash elemental. I guess probably should have dropped burning core Drake. I don't know what I was thinking. <laughs> Start to get delirious. That's okay. Let's crank it out for these last two games to get there. Oh my gosh. <laughs> okay. Okay. What do we do here? Oh, I guess. Wait a second. <laughs> Let's go with Fire Sigil Swing. We'll get three damage in at least. I don't mind getting two for one. Okay. Hopefully it doesn't mean they have another dragon. Cause that would be bad. <sighs> Let's go with, so if we plop this down and, and decimate, we'd have four power. We could play the Ash Elemental and the Covetous Stranger. I think that's a fine deal, right? Let's do that, that seems good. Four, four is pretty, pretty scary for us. Up land for us. Okay. They don't want us drawing cards. That's fine. I mean, we'd have to have attacked into their dragon. Ooh. Okay, so it's six health. How to do this? <laughs> um, I guess Sol Fury could work. Sol Fury is just a spell, not a fast spell. Okay. Um, let's see. How can we do this?
carve it. I don't know. I'm kind of just... Let's attack and see what they do. Because they know they have carve it. Yeah, let's, uh, let's blaze and sell them. Golly. Well, they just decimated us. Let's see if we can't uh, bring it around on the Menace Dragons. They got Ted Power of the Air. Let's drop four. See what we can do. Or ten attack in the air. Whew. Looks like we got just decimated towards the end of this tourney. But let's not lose hope yet. There's always next game. I just want to see what we draw. Maybe there's something there. And a good game. Well played, well played. Alright, we're up against Cosmiker. Final game. Let's see what we can get done. Alright. Um, I want to see if we can get a better hand than this. We're going for a super optimistic hand here. Yeah, I like that. Got Ruthless Stranger. And then we get the three, we're doing great. If we could not, well... There's always Char Chain Flail. Okay, Cosmiker. What do you got, my friend? I think we can go ahead and just say it's a good kill. That's worth the char chain flail, I would say. Now we really, really are relying on there being a power sigil, or a, a fire sigil, or any power. Didn't happen. Let's swing. We can get there. We can get there. Are we fighting against paladins? Probably just Archport good stuff. It's way more likely. But maybe paladins supplementing cultists for certain cultist energies? Okay. Ouch. Uh, so they get two power. It really messes with us, actually. So we can't end a turn kill something. Okay, now that got life steal. That would be pretty bad. The quick draw hurts. Just gonna make sure that that uh, one one lives. What do you got up? What? What's? What, what do you got up there? What do you got? Okay. Ooh, eight five. Um, maybe chump with the burning core Drake, but I don't know. If that leaves as many options going forward. Hmm. Maybe chump with the stranger. I mean, we're not getting too far if we try to rush them, but we'll, we'll, we'll go ahead and try it. We'll see. I mean, we're mono fire. If we're going to do anything real well, that's it. That's our... That's our path. I mean... 
burn is the way. Let's see what we could get done. Da -da -da -da. Da -da 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 -da. Final match, hype. Let's see what we can do. All right. Um. Hmm. How do we deal with an eight-five Aegis unit? That's probably something we should ask ourselves way, way long ago at the beginning of this tournament. <laughs> but I didn't think we we're gonna necessarily see that. It just. This is the first time it's really come up, so it's not. It's not like the end of the world. Uh, we really need just toughness. We just need lots of toughness. And then, well, we actually need like nine toughness. And then, nine, we need a nine five. Or no, a five nine. If we can get a five nine, we can kill that thing. Um, hmm. I'm trying to figure out what we should do here. Uh, I think we just swing in, right? Let's just swing in. And we can kill an attachment. It'll destroy the Aegis. Okay, I didn't think about that. Let's throw down a Yeti Cookmaster as a chump blocker. And then we will consider that as an option. they don't get overwhelmed too we're good so we can sear that uh, get rid of their quick draw as a possibility we just need a little bit more power um, let's see that we need to just start uh, we have to swing I think just one I think just with the flyer yeah we're not gonna completely burn them out it's not happening That's a good game. Well played. Uh, if you liked this uh, tournament coverage, if you enjoyed the video, go ahead and hit that like button. Um, and subscribe if you want to see more content like this. I really appreciate you watching the tournament. Um, definitely had a blast. Really fun. And I love the card back. Plays pretty well, honestly. 13-15s. Uh, you know, not going to get us in the top 64, but I mean, hey, it's better than going, like, getting a really low score, like, we could have gotten, got 34 packs, so, couldn't ask for more. Have a great night, I'll see you next time.